Hey everyone, it's Rob, and welcome to my next video in my Daikatana Let's Play. Now, this Let's Play is going to be in preparation of a series of videos I would like to do, talking about the overly loved and overly panned uh, stuff in today's society, be it video games or movies or whatever. So, um, I'm, this is going to be the last time I mention in a while, as it's going to get tiresome hearing me mention it over and over and me talking about it over and over. So, I'll mention it every once in a while, though. So, the next level here is Crematorium. The difficulty does spike here. And, and uh, it's going to keep spiking until the end of this uh, until the end of this episode. Then it'll be Cakewalk after that. So, yeah. Um, you also see me use Sidekicks for the first time. To blow up the guards around the corner. Say what? Have Superfly pick up his first weapon. Come on, pick it I'm up. I'm on it. Thank you. I'm cool with but that. But I'll have them hang back as I'm more of a classic gamer, and I definitely do prefer to to um, it to just fight stuff by myself. Though I do use them on occasion. side of that glass later on in the level. You guys will see it, so. Funny enough, the items later on in the level aren't in there. That's a really tough part of the level. Okay, we're gonna blow open this uh, coffee table for the first secret, and grab this power power up. This is gonna be very useful in the next area here. We'll come back for Superfly later. because I'm going to throw some C4 around the corner there for those guys that like to shoot you in the back when you take care of the turrets behind me. There we go. Actually, this is turning out rather well. Did I lose some health for me the turrets or those guys? Okay. I'm just going to go to the second secret here. Very obvious. It's just the Haas portal around the side of the building here. Okay, I'm just going to go grab Superfly, and my next thing I have to do is to, I'll just pick up this stuff, Superfly likes to steal those, um, let's put him in front of that door that I'm going to be opening remotely, so this, this way when it's open, he'll attack stuff inside, that is, unless he screws up and just forgets that I told him I'm to stay way. and just, <laughs> and decides to, uh, <laughs> And then you just could, decides to, ask uh, me to move. just follow me when I didn't tell him to. Sometimes the AI does that. It's a little annoying when they forget the commands that that you that you uh, give them. That's my main gripe with the AI. It's that's some sort of a programming issue. I'm assuming. I'll hang. Alrighty, so he's staying there. Now the next secret is up there. But uh, I'm going to go up from this area to this side. One, because it's easier in the truck. Two, because it's next to where I'm going to jump down and I'm going to kill some enemies. So I'll just rocket jump up here. You can see as I hold the left it's here because it was higher up. It went up much higher. I'm getting 
better at that, I used to lose almost all my health in this area. So I won't be using much much of that health in the secret, but uh, yeah, I will still pick up the ultimate gas hands. Well laid plan will uh my best laid plan will work. Oh. I just tell him to stay just in case because that guard might have taken him out of his uh weight pose. There we go. So there's three things in here. This one opens up the door. Or no, the other one opens up the door. That one opens up the gate. Not really needed. This one turns off an alarm. The second one turns off an alarm, which I don't need to do. And good, Supervise still there. So they'll start attacking him, and he'll start fighting the enemies for me. And that guy is uh, pumping the glass, so we'll go take care of him. So, still one more left. The next secret is in here. You just blow away this uh, barbed wire, which this barbed wire can actually. Uh, can actually hurt you if you jump up to it, like above the fence there. So there we go. I believe there should be a few more enemies left. This guy, the enemy that just for some reason will never show up, no matter how many times I play this level. And the frogs in the water. So there's some armor down here. So far, so good. This level's going quite well. I did attempt this once or twice, but just the Daikatana wasn't with me those days. There's also some C4 behind that uh, that rock over there, but I don't need it. Superfly is. 
you gotta watch out for the ventilation fans. But yeah, they'll kill you on impact. Or on contact, I should say. Both. But yeah, I really do love the level design in this game. The level design and the music, I think, are the two best aspects. But the gameplay is also really good. There's just a few bugs here and there. Nothing game-breaking. Maybe in, like, 1.1, but ever since then, things have been fixed so that it's perfectly playable. Um, but yeah, it's, it's funny how in newer games, if you don't like a game that's popular and new, people are like, ah, oh, play it for four or five hours. It gets good after that. People aren't willing to give games with a bad reputation the same consideration, you know. But I digress, so just blow up the guys around that corner there. And yeah, I'll take out those guards and the box up there and the and the box with the C4 all in one fell swoop, so it's pretty dark. Where is that boy? There, there it goes. Next secret. So when I opened up that door, the door back here opened up as well. And behind this grate is the last weapon of this episode. This is the shot cycler. It clears up rooms, but it also hurts you. And it can also break the level a little bit, but that only makes it more fun, I guess. <laughs> we'll see. Oh, actually, I guess I didn't get to use it because somehow the guards got alerted, and now they're not so unaware of that. I guess I gotta do this in the fashion. I'll use the shock. I'll, I'll use the uh, shock wave. One more of those. Still attacking people. No, it's me to back. Like back down. Pick up your weapon. No way, Jose. Oh, you distracted them. Great job, hero. Damn it! I wonder how long they keep these bodies in here. I want to keep that keep up. Oh, you're just punching stuff on. That works. One more of those, and I'll take your eyes out. Stay there while I go back for some ammo and help. That didn't go as planned, but let's play Zane perfect, right? This next part's a little tricky. I might be coming back for help a little later. There's a lot of those guards, which can hurt you quite a bit. So. Get off me! Just pick up your shot cycle. Shut up. <laughs> that's the first time that's happened to me. I haven't seen that before. Guards like that. Oh well. Looks like all the guards are dead. That's not too shabby. Must have uh, killed them when my back was when I was going back to help. Thank you, Superfly. Really paying attention. At least I think that's what happened. I guess I won't know until I go back and walk, watch the level again. Oh, hey. So I'll have Superfly hang back there because we've got to go around to open up that door now.
may do not be many key cards in this game. There's a lot of uh, old stuff. So far, so good. It's just the vents now. And one NPC right there. Awesome. But it all depends on how good these turrets are to me, so... Runs, there's more space, so they'll shoot above me like that, so that's good. Now, just these enemies, and I'm set for the rest of them. There's a health, there's a host portal over there, so I'll actually uh, blow up the enemies like that so I don't have to worry about it. How's my rockets looking? Yeah, I can pick up these rockets. Next leg of the level done, uneventful. I have to admit that there was some cool stuff that happened in previous attempts that unfortunately I won't get to see. It, 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 that we won't get to see in the final product, but what do you do? I'll use that shockwave, for instance, later on. So, I'll be there in a sec. Come on. Hey, man. Alrighty, what, what next area. Okay, so oh, this next area is quite tough, especially with uh, two characters constantly bumping into one another in narrow hallways with hit scanners all around. So I'm just gonna have I'm cool Superfly stick back What's while that? I take care of this first part of me. Technically, this isn't too tough, but since this is a let's play, I don't want to keep running back to the previous level constantly to, to heal up, so I'm gonna try to go back here only once. So, yeah. Let's see how this goes. So far, so far. Oh, one more guy. Taking out these turrets and taking out the guards is tough. Now, this next area, enemies just flood in. So, I'm going to try to take out the majority of them with the secret one. That got rid of most of them here. Oh, I'm stuck in the door there. Sometimes that does happen. It's kind of unavoidable. It happens with doors with and explosions near doors. So, Alright, this is. Let's see, 4 worked out rather well. Let me try to use C4 a little bit here. That's good enough for me. Six out. That works. So let's go back. I say that's pretty cool. Save those rockets for later. So yeah. There we go. I should be home free now. The rest of the level ain't so bad. But yeah, with the crematorium, there's not much um, health in that first section, and it's a good place to sort of save 
Like I said, I'm trying to do this with with as, as few manual, manual saves as possible. Yes, you don't have to worry about the save gems anymore as of 1.2, but there we go. I want to make this as clean as possible. Maybe a Let's Play, but... Okay, so now I can bring Superfly with me. I guess I could have brought him with me, but would have been more of an annoyance than anything else. So I should have only one more secret left. And I'm cool with that. Just stick right there while I take care of the stuff. This area, but I'm trying to get about the reason why I went back besides ammo is to grab some And I still have the last leg of this level left. So I'm going up through the grates and I'm going to get this door to open once I enter this area back here. And then I'll grab Superfly one last time and finish the level. Then it's on to processing after that, so. Processing isn't that that bad. There's just a few sticky areas towards the, the end. It's one of the shorter levels. Just behind here. Just some armor. There we go. On to the next level, processing. Which actually is quite the fun level. Chill dude, I'm coming. I'll be there in a sec. Come on. I'm on my way! Here. Thank you. Thus concludes this level. Let's watch the cutscene. Oh, there's no cutscene. Okay. Saving my game, and this concludes this part. Next time it's processing. Thank you for watching.